Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here with your host, not the most, Mr. Blue aka Tommy Miller. Folks, we got the land all trailer up here and we're getting fuel for the truck right now. Now we're going to go ahead and move this out of the trigger. We're going to shut this off for now. Alright, the land all trailer has an update. Uh, I haven't got it installed so we can switch it out or anything. I gotta sell this in first and then uh, take this mod out of the folder, put the new mod in the folder, and then uh, go from there. So yeah, we gotta sell it first for the update to work. So, um, oh yeah, there's three pieces. We might not buy this third piece next time around, just saying. All right, um, it wants us to repair for $14. We're going to do that. Then we're going to sell. Yes. Um, repair for $28. Oh, we put a lot of damage on that thing, didn't we? Uh, repair for $6. And we're going to sell that. All right. So, okay. Um, yeah, we're up uh, $1.2 million, folks. And, uh... Let me go get to the lawnmower tractor, or lawnmower tractor, to the to the mower. We'll soon be using this, folks. We'll soon be using this. Let me go check on the cotton so y'all can see it. All right, try to get where y'all can see the writing over in the bottom right. It's cotton owned by me. Growth is growing. Uh, growth stage is eight of eight, which it should be ready, but that's that's not. That's got blooms on it. It's not cotton yet, so. We'll have to go a little bit longer. Uh, get this back where you can see it good, about right there. As you can see, pH value is perfect, but nitrogen is bad. Why is it bad? Well, we're 185 over 100. It should be good, right? No, we got too much nitrogen on it. So, uh, crop rotation is perfect. Uh, before this, it was uh, nothing. Expected yield as a hundred and eleven percent yield potential is a hundred percent so yeah but uh it, it, it likes one more growth stage they should show it with cotton bowls on it too but and they didn't all right there's something else i want to show y'all i'm gonna keep my head down so y'all won't see it um this is the little power building here on uh, you know, there's a house behind me, and then back over here was the pig area and stuff, and all these trees and stuff like that. But anyway, this is what I want to show you. Our little John Deere uh, 50G has an update to it. Um, actually, this is by FS Miner. He does logs and stuff, and he does the terraform. Look at these rocks here we dug up. Probably should have made it dirt, but. You know, it was some rocks here at one time, so it's legit. We dug a little hole here. We're going to tie into this uh, meter loop right here. Electricity said we can just run it off this since this is ours. It feeds the areas around here, but these old lines are old, and we're going to cut them off and redo and lay new lines, and we're going to take them over to here. And this is the new house that we got built. They finally got it built. But here's the meter coming in. I wish this was on like a construction sim. It had some way of finding a house that looked just like this and the machine like that. So we actually like pretty close where we could just switch over and pretend we was doing it. You know what I mean? But anyway, we're going to come right under the post there, our porch and come over to here, tie it in. And then uh, it'll be ready for somebody to move in. Now the question is, who are we going to move in? Is it Colin and Julian Vlogs? Is it Mr. Yankee from Yankees Outdoor Adventures? Dan from 3D, uh, 3D Gaming and 3D Outdoors. Wow, well, even got the bicycle here. <laughs> that would probably be Mr. Yankee because he does a lot of walking and stuff on his videos. So he would probably ride a bike to work. This thing. No, uh, uh, whatever it's called uh, but anyway yeah 
I don't know if this house has a sleep trigger or not. I haven't really. I think it's just a regular house. Yeah, I don't see no sleep triggers, so. Oh! Okay. Might have some uh, bacon, eggs, and cheese biscuits out here with whoever moves in. Okay, I'm making myself hungry. Gotta quit talking about that. Alright. You seen the cotton? Now we gotta get mowing because it's 8 11 in the morning and we'll go look at our soybeans real quick. Alright, here's our soybeans. You can see this in here is uh, growth stage is 6 6 and it says foliage. So that's why I'm thinking the cotton is an even, num even number. So I figure. It, it's in the foliage stage, but here's what it looks like when it gets ready to harvest. Still a little green tips you can see every once in a while. Like right there where the cursor is, like little green leaves on it. But it is said ready to harvest. Let's go in here and look at it. Alright, here we go. We're gonna go um, over. No, no, no. Oh, that way, yeah. Almost forgot the controls. Um, growth. You can probably see right there it's in the like the darkest green so it should be ready next we gotta get soil samples on this but I'm waiting till we harvest the cotton then get the soil samples uh, that would be all in one but as you can see here we got grass that's ready to mow and we got beans ready to cut and here's the rest of the beans yeah it likes it a little bit from being ready and as far as the uh, soil and stuff um, we're 54 here and 58 on this block which would be this 71 here 46 33 32 because we ain't got nothing in them yet and we go over here this is 50 42 42 and we got 45 29 and 81 so we need to bring those numbers up because we're all the other we're 52 right now on our um, precision farming and stuff and if you go in here um, let's see I, I, I don't have a mouse so oh I see it now uh, it's the first line and the second line and like I said I don't have a, a mouse my mouse is not working for some reason but anyway, we're going to go mow some grass and we'll uh, be right back. We're going to go mow some grass and uh, we're going to get the other guy to uh, collect it. Be right back. All right, bring the tractor over here so we can have it and see our honey pile. This here is starting to be pretty good. Shoot this off right here. But yeah, 2,000 liters of honey. And we got some strawberries here. Go ahead and move them all over here for now. And we might, I don't know, we're gonna, we're probably gonna keep these strawberries for a little bit and the honey. We're gonna start getting them production buildings and stuff, so. Alright, let's fire this bad boy up. And I think... And now I better not go that way. I'm going to go down here and turn around and come back this way. That way I know I can fit through it. Or because I, I know I probably won't be able to fit through. Yeah, it's kind of narrow. Alright, go ahead and... Start her up. And swap dropping we don't need swap dropping but that'd be all right all right I'm going to shut up and make a speed of this so I'll see you when I get done
All right, folks, before we get going too far, I need to put some fuel in this thing. Because we got a big field down south around the new house thing down there that we need to do. And I think I didn't use all the diesel fuel around here. I'm going to have to get the other truck. I'm going to shut that off there. We got our other 8RX in here with the baler on it. I think we might get some straw. Oh, we do have diesel fuel here. Okay. Uh, question is, which side is the fuel tank on? Um, Y'all see a fuel cap anywhere? Huh. I have no idea. Surely that's not it by the exhaust right there. Ooh. All right, start filling. All right, she's a fool. We're gonna park her out of the way for right now because Mr. Yanker did call me while I was doing all that and uh, said that we can harvest. And uh, so we're gonna head on over there. And oh, before I forget, of course, you know, we got to sell a load of logs. Yeah, not very many, but we got some. And went for 28,119. Cool. And also, uh, before, let's see, I'm not going to get back in that. How? All right. Playing the dabbing uh, or game or whatever it's called. Uh, you have to tab through all the vehicles. All right. I'm going to leave the Star Wealth on and see what we get here. Supposed to be getting some straw for this. Yep, we're getting straw. Good. Don't clip the guide wires. There we go. Ooh. Uh, corn, soybeans, uh, stuff like that can give us straw. I think even uh, sorghum or milo, whichever one you want to call it. Alright, so far it looks like her. Oh, wow, is there a moisture that low? 9.6, 9.7? Uh, that's a little bit dry. I didn't think they were this dry, but look at the dust. They're, pre they're pretty dry, folks. So, uh. But of course, we ain't got very much to harvest. Probably either later this evening or tomorrow before the rest of them be ready. So, but that's usually the way it goes. Um, Y'all yeah, like first person, third person. I kind of like looking into the controls and stuff every once in a while, but. Every now and then, you know, got to break up the stuff and do different ways show different things for y'all. It's not bad. It's kind of real life. It's just a little bit different on some certain things you do. I'm going to slow down here. I don't want to take too much of the green in. Oop. Might have got a few limbs there. Or not limbs, but leaves. Alright, not bad, not bad at all. Oh, look at there. Alright, I'm gonna hire uh, Dan to run the combine. And we're gonna get out and run. We'll probably won't need it, but I'm going to go ahead and get it fired up. Actually, well, no. I need that one semi truck to be right back. Alright, I'm back. I'm going to go get this truck hooked up to this trailer. We don't need it for nothing right now, but I do want to pick up the 
stuff we got, like strawberries and stuff, in a way. Keeps them a little bit cooler than this truck, but I want to get it out of the way here. So we're going to, I guess, fill that bag. I really don't want to fill the bag, but I know the, the prices right now are down pretty low. Alright, as you can see right here, hmm, Farmer's Market's doing $3,000 right now for soybeans. And that's probably the best price there is, and we won't have to worry about putting in a bagger. And, um, oh, back to soybeans, go over. And I'm going to tag the place. I think I know where it's at. Yeah, it's right there. Okay. So, uh, untag. Alright, let's see if we're about getting our tractor fired up here. Let's see if Mr. Yankee made it to the end. Oh, yeah, on the way back down. So, I'm going to park this guy right here. And I wish I had a way of seeing. No, I don't have the thing. So I'm going to turn this off. I'm going to go down here, see what Dan's got in so far. I know it probably won't make that much, but. Uh, let me in. There we go. Oh, he might not make it. All right, let me find the tractor and Baylor. Get him over here real quick. All right, I'm gonna go, go ahead and fold this. Yeah, he's got a pretty full tank. I doubt he'll make it to the end. Uh, there's some things I want to do to settings on that. Let's see if we can unload on the go. Start engine. For, oh, he's backing all out in the crops. Dan, why are you doing that? Got his way. Hey, hey, hey. Alright, they're going to be really rough on the straw. Please unload. Oh, thank you. Remember that problem we was having with the other trailer wouldn't unload? Well, it's unloading on the go with this and so that's good. That's saving us some time. So yeah, we'll be doing the rest of the soybeans and uh, probably be doing the cotton too at the same time. Uh, yeah. Or that, I'll just make two different videos on it. Y'all tell me what y'all want, which I'll probably have it recorded by then, I don't know. Um, yeah, I do have uh, 9 and 10 and 11 recorded and edited a construction sim. Well, 11 is not edited yet, but it's getting close. I did have a mod tell how full we are, but I don't know, I guess, uh, yeah, he's he's empty so that's good now I'm just going to park this right here and go get our other tractor boy I wish I could run like this in real life Woo! I, I, I'd be so happy alright the settings I want to make is I want the let's see it's an L yeah, it looks like L 220 240 all right, biggest bales we got is 240, so that's what I want to do. And current bale is 13. I want to reset baler count, so it's Control Alt and Y. Let's see, Control Alt and Y. Current bale count is zero, so that's what I wanted. And go ahead and let that down. I guess might well get GPS. I don't know. We probably won't use GPS. And there we go. We're picking up the bell straw. Or the straw. The soybean straw. That's what I was trying to say. Now, I don't know if it makes a difference or not, but we got our first straw bell. Ooh, that's 240. And look how 
fast we done got a bail out. Okay, I'm going to pick that up. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. And I don't want to block the drive. We've been coming through this way, cutting across sometimes with our loads. Let's drop them right over here. So that's going to be two bales to a through. Um, unload baler, be why. All right, and that is um eight thousand two hundred and fifty liters per bale, folks. Wait, that's eight thousand two hundred and fifty for. This is 4.30 and it shows 9,000. Okay, I don't get it. Oh, I probably, oh, probably when I switched it. So 9,000 liters per straw bell. Okay, I get in this other tractor because he should be full. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Stop, 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 stop. Now, nah, Mr. Yankee, sorry. Had to fire you for a second. Oh, you're not even... got anything in you. What was I thinking? Yeah, we need to get us a semi-tipper so or a charter so we can dump these beans in the head. Uh, but that's... Uh, We'll, we'll get that next year when we get our bigger combine because yeah this combine's going back y'all or we're going to sell it it's not going back because I don't know where it came from alright Dan you can have your machine back get this tractor out of the way shut it off um how did that straw get there I have no idea. Anyway. Start. Oh, it was started. I just killed it. Huh. Okay. Start. Baylor. I know I don't have access to this land. I know I have a little chunks over here for. Okay. I got them up. I always like to lift my wings up when I go back up. Just so I won't break nothing. We should be good to go now. He, Dan was empty. He should hopefully finish that up over because a little bit tinier, shorter rows. Uh, probably gonna have to help him on the turnaround up here. Or not. Look like it's doing pretty good. We'll wait and give benefit of the doubt anyway. Two bales in. I'm gonna go ahead and drop these unload baler. Oh, got to turn off and then unload baler. Baler back on. All right, folks. I really don't know how much I got recorded, so I'm gonna bring y'all back at the end when we get this section. Um, done harvesting and stuff and I'll bring y'all back then uh, don't go nowhere I am I'm not ending the video I'm just uh, I'm going to do a jump cut all right just got through well that little bit of soybeans we got I'm leaving that little strip over I'm gonna do a test on it but um, I'm gonna get the total amount here as soon as it gets done Almost done. Almost. Alright, pull the pipe in. I'm gonna get this out of the way. We're just gonna park over here. And yes, sending up over one when you're low on uh, fuel and death, Mr. Blue. You need to fill it up. 
We're going to let it run out. Hopefully we'll have enough to do this spill. Because uh, that combine's going bye-bye. So the total on the soybeans so far is 9,734 liters. And yeah, I'm just going to leave this tractor sitting here too. And uh, we're going to finish doing the bales. I am not going to sell these bales yet. I'm going to let y'all see how much we get in total. That's also why I reset the bell counter. I do want to get these. I, I got to make sure we get everything out of this guy's field because this grassland here is not ours. It's probably about four foot from from here, probably about right here. So yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll get them off uh, off screen. So uh, yeah, uh, we get down to here. I want to show y'all this real quick. We're starting on this tree line area here. And as you can see, we got all the way down on this side. So this is ready. This field's ready. Uh, we just gotta get this finished up. We'll probably relocate this road a little bit closer or something so we can have more land here. But folks, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. And um, thank you for the likes, the shares, the subs. Um, share me with your friends because um, I'm going to try to reach a thousand this year um, I, I know y'all can do it y'all can share me out your buddies and pals and all them and uh, get me on up there yeah I'd love to have that many I don't know what to do with all y'all commenting that, oh, with that many but I'll try my best to keep up but anyway I gotta get off here folks. It's uh getting late and uh I will talk to y'all in the next episode. So have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see you later.